Hello everybody, today we are trying out more snacks from Australia. First of all, thank you to Kinuyo, Landolf, Kazuya for sending us these snacks from your beautiful country. They also have two dogs, so we want to give a shout out to their dogs, Minka and Pankun or Pan. I, 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 I'm sorry, I can't read it. But um, yeah, hello to your dogs as well. Now, this is really interesting. Most of these things we're going to try out today are potato chips. Yay! And, um, all of them, I gotta say, <coughs> are flavor combinations that I've never had before. So I'm really, really excited. They also mentioned on their letter that these Red Rock chips always come out with the most interesting flavor combinations. So, mm. and, 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 and it's some of their favorite chips. Mm. So I'm really looking forward to these. The first one is honey soy chicken flavor. Mmm, mm, sounds delicious. It really does. Mm. You know, here in Japan, we're used to unusual flavored potato chips, but sometimes they can go really, really crazy, like mm. cream soda mm. flavor. But this one sounds pretty normal and delicious. Mm -hmm. sounding. Uh, yeah, sound is very delicious. I I have I have had the honey flavored potato chips, mm -hmm. and I have had soy sauce. That's taste. true. Soy sauce taste potato chips are quite usual. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And chicken is also good. So yeah, this is a very good three combination. I think so. It makes a lot of sense. So once again, this chip is from the Red Rock Deli. Dakimasu. Dakimasu. Mm. Mm. Super crispy. Mm. These are kettle chips. Mm. I haven't. I haven't tasted the combination of soy sauce and honey. Mm. But you know, like it makes a lot of sense to me because. Mm -hmm. You know, um, it's like teriyaki sauce. Right, you have soy right, sauce and like sugar. Like sauce. But instead mm. of sugar, it's like honey. So you get that that, that deep flavor of honey. Mm. This is what it tastes mm. like. It's like crispy fried chicken with a honey soy glaze. That's what it tastes like. Now this is another delicious looking one. And uh, this is a limited edition. I think the honey soy one, they always have it. This one is, is a limited edition. And this is a Thai chili and lime potato chips. Thai chili and lime. Right. And I mm, want to point it out that- sign, sounds very delicious. Yes, and I want to point out that all these chips are natural flavors and natural colorings and no MSG added. Mm. So they're, 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 they're fairly healthy. I realize. I can smell the potato from this bag. Really? Really, really potato smell. Really? Mm -hmm. And I like this package picture, package design. That's true. It's very, very sophisticated. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, Takima. Mmm! Mmm! Oh! I taste yeah. cilantro. Mm. I taste cilantro. Mm. Definitely has that lime Thai flavor. Mm -hmm. mm. Thai flavor and lime. And a little bit of kick. It just kicked me in my mouth right now. There is a slight Ooh. sweetness. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. The slight sweetness and the sourness of lime. Yeah, yeah. Mm. It, it's like it's like they squeeze lime juice mm. over mm. everything. Mm. Mm. The next one is sweet chili and sour cream. Oh. Yay, sour cream! And that you know, combining sour cream with sweet chili, that's yes. new to me. Yes. You know? Yes. Oh. Oh. Ooh, mm. Kinuyo-san, you were not kidding when you said that these are amazing chips because these really are. I want to buy Instagram also. <laughs> Me too. Oh, these are good. Mmm, my god. Mmm, good. Oh, yeah. Mmm, mm. I like sour cream. Yes. Mm. But combining it with a sweet chili, mm -hmm. it adds like this sweetness that you usually don't find combined with sour cream. And it also has a kick. Mm -hmm. I realize this flavor has a similar, similar flavor of natto. I totally disagree. There is no natto flavor in this one. So what is wrong with your taste buds? My descri description is wrong, I know. But I can taste the natto umami. Natto umami. umami. So what is that? Exactly. What is a natto umami? It's a natto umami. That's <laughs> natto umami. Please eat natto. You can understand what natto umami is. Whatever. This is really good stuff. 
All right, the next one is a different brand. This is the Kettle brand, and this is the Taste Sensations. Oh, and, Taste Sensations. And this one is... Give me is, sensation. And this is by far the most interesting flavor of all. This is Camembert and Fig. Huh? Yeah, Camembert <laughs> cheese with figs. I see. Potato chips. I see. <clears throat> but I can't imagine how delicious it is. I, I, I just can't imagine at all. Really? Uh, like, that sounds good. I like camembert cheese and I like fig. Me too, me too. But not always do they translate well into potato chips, you know? But um, I mean, I, I, I guess it makes sense. I mean, I can imagine cheese with figs. I can imagine how good that would be. It must be good. Mm, mm. Cheese, cheese. Mm -hmm. mm. Um, I'm not getting yeah. it. The sweetness of the fig. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Cheese, very good sweetness of fig. And it's definitely a camembert cheese. Mm. It's not like a cheddar cheese or, you know, like a, a mild cheese. It's more of that, it has that mm. camembert taste. Mm. And it has a sweetness, mm. but a very, very complex flavor, I tell mm. you. This one is very complex. So I think you would either hate this one or love this one. The next one is not potato chips. It's Kalman's Gourmet Protein Bars. Oh, huh? protein bars. Salted dark chocolate and almond flavor. Oh, that sounds good. Hinuyo says that she's never tried this actual flavor, but all the other flavors are very yummy. And what I personally like about this is that it's gluten-free. There's a lot of roasted peanuts. It says it's fruit-free. So I guess it's good for people who are trying to limit their fruit intake. Um, a fruit free? Yeah, uh -huh. yeah. And just like the potato chips, uh, this brand is proudly made in Australia. In many cases, they have the raisin. Raisins. Mm -hmm. Yeah, like yeah. That. A lot of times there's raisins, mm -hmm. cranberries, and things like this. But this is fruit free. Yeah. Are you talking about? Oh. Mm. Mm. Oh, this is. Oh, oh, this is, mm. tastes really natural. Can I say something? First of all, mm -hmm. I'm very familiar with these types of uh, protein bars because mm -hmm. I love them. Mm -hmm. I, I love nut bars, fruit bars, you know, protein bars, things like this. I, I, I do. But a lot of them taste very, very dry or some of them are actually not that delicious. This one actually tastes indulgent. This one is like a sweet indulgent treat mm. Mm, but healthy mm. one of the better tasting protein bars i've had in my life mm. you know and there's so much goodness in there there's like peanuts there's like chocolate drizzled on the top um there's like pumpkin seeds sunflower seeds um almonds there's a whole bunch of mm. stuff in here but it once again not dry and it's just super super delicious let's go picnic with this now in the hot sun I don't think so. The next one is one of Kinyo san's childhood favorites. This is called a flake bar and it's from Cadbury. It's simple and it's fun. She says it also gets a little bit messy. Like the package mm. says, it's the crumbliest milk chocolate ever. It looks like a tree bark to me. So I, 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 like, I, I like how visually unique it is. Uh -huh. you know, it's like a wood. Yeah, yeah, exactly. Yeah. Interesting and it's super crumbly, just like the package says. Talking about Whoa. Hmm? Unexpectedly soft. It simply melted in my mouth. Mm hmm Because it was so crumbly and kind of hard when I tried to break it. When mm -hmm. you put it in your mouth, it kind of just melts, <laughs> doesn't it? A surprise. Mm -hmm. I, I expected the the crispy crispy texture. Me too. The 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 visual the visual. It's like that. Mm. The mm -hmm. This is not. Mm. Oh, it's so soft. It just, you don't have to bite it. It just kind of melts. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Oh my god. It's milky. It's a little mm. bit malty, mm. I think. Mm. 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 This is, that's pretty surprising. The last one is not from Australia. It's from Poland. Mm. But her favorite. Kinyo-san's favorite. Yeah, she, she thinks that this is one of the best milk chocolates in the world, which is why she included it in the package and she wanted us to try it. So thank you. We are definitely going to try it right now. The name is Green and Black's Organic Milk Chocolate. And it's also fair trade. 
so I really like that. Mm -hmm. It's it's a pretty big chocolate bar. Mm -hmm. um, you know, because our chocolate bars here in Japan are quite small. <laughs> Alright, back in one. This one tastes different to me. It, this, you know, the, on the last um, food review that we did, the last international food review we did, you mentioned that one of the chocolate tasted like miso. This one tastes <laughs> like miso to me. You get that's it? <laughs> well, this one does. The so, other one didn't. This one tastes like there's miso so in here. I, I made my face very strange when I buy this because the taste is really like, it contains really like miso. Yeah. It means umami. Yeah. It's a fermented umami flavor. Fermented umami flavor. Mm. Now, of course, it is not miso taste, but it's like a fermented umami flavor. Yeah. Mm. I don't know why. It is chocolate. I know. That's why I, I, I was speechless for a moment mm -hmm. there because mm -hmm. I didn't know what to say. Mm -hmm. I didn't know what I was eating. Wow. I'm very happy you understand about the miso I do. chocolate. <laughs> <laughs> but 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 the last time I didn't agree with really? you. Today I think really? I think it tastes like miso. Really? My tongue has more sensitive than you. <laughs> Once again, thank you so much, Kinuyo, Randolph, and Kazu, who was just born. Thank you very much. Um, they also just started their own channel, Life with Kazu. Mm -hmm. If you're interested, check it out. It documents their life with their newborn baby, and it's a lot of fun. So, what is your favorite of today? Alright, this one, for me, this one is a no-brainer. My favorite was the sweet chili and sour cream ah, potato chips. See, yeah, I, I mm. thought it was going to be the Thai chili one, but this one, th th this combination is like perfecto mundo. It's a perfect combination. Mm, I understand. My favorite one is Thai chili and lime, you mentioned now. Okay, that's so. your favorite? I also like this one. Okay. So today's a big two. Okay, but you like this one more? Uh -huh. Really? Interesting. So this is mine. This is mine. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, thanks so much guys for watching. Don't forget to thumbs it up. Leave your comments down below. If you're new to this channel and you enjoy these kind of food reviews, don't forget to subscribe. So, I will enjoy beer with this snack. Bye!